Hey babes, long time no talk. Welcome back to the vlog channel. I feel like the last two weeks have been some of the most hectic, crazy weeks of my life. Thanks COVID. So, um, I, well, I just got done working out, so I'm actually in a sports bra, but I, um, wow, it's been crazy. So my friend got married this past weekend. Um, I'm not quite sure when you'll be able to watch this, like whenever I'll get time to sit down and edit it, but my friend got married this past weekend and it was so perfect. We were actually really nervous. She wasn't going to be able to have the wedding even up until, excuse me, like the week of she had gotten a call from, um, one of her vendors and like, it, it basically was just, we weren't going to know until like literally the day before if this wedding was actually going to happen. Um, it was really sad because some family members didn't get to come in town, but ultimately it was beautiful and she got married. But the whole reason it's been so crazy is because like I had to bulk plan my content for the weekend that I was going to be gone because we were leaving on a Thursday and then like early on a Thursday, we were going to be gone Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So I had to like prep everything ahead of time. And then I also had to like go ahead and get the next week's stuff ready because we weren't going to be there. So it's been chaotic to say the least. <coughs> Zeus, you're being rude. Um, I've got to make dinner now. I don't feel the best because I ate a handful of M&Ms before I worked out. I knew I shouldn't have. They just made me feel like, ugh, shouldn't have done that. I know better than to eat before I work out. Um, but I've got to make dinner now. I'm gonna make some chicken and just broccoli, nothing crazy, because neither Sam nor I are super hungry. And then I have absolutely no idea what I'm gonna be doing for the rest of the night. So, there's that. <laughs> Oh, one more thing. I look like such a dork right now. I've got on socks and bedroom slippers. But like I said, I just got done working out and I just threw a t-shirt on. Um, look at these cute shoes. I've been meaning to show you guys these. Oh my gosh, if you follow me on Instagram, you've already seen them. How cute are these? Oh my goodness. They're not everyone's cup of tea, I'm sure. But like my husband thinks these are the world's ugliest shoes. He was like, you're not allowed to wear those out with me jokes on him and i also got these boots these are like vince Camuto. i mean obviously i know it is not the season for boots but i wanted them so bad i've been eyeing them for so long um they're like the nester boots i think is what they're called nestel i'm not quite sure i'll link them below um but they are like 250 dollars boots and i found them on sale the other day for 94. i was like okay i love vince Camuto, so i cannot wait to wear those during the fall time. Just wanted to show this. I've turned my shoes back the right way. I had them kind of, um, these are actually, these are Sam's shoes here, but they don't all, those don't all fit because his shoes are a lot wider. I had them kind of staggered because they weren't all fitting and then I ended up getting rid of a few pairs um, of shoes and then I put some more back behind the tennis shoes. But, these are all my like random ones that I like want. These are like my newer shoes that I want to wear a little bit more. Um, so that's why I keep those up there. And then eventually after I've had them for a while, they go down here except for these as well. Got these from Amazon. 40 bucks. Very cute. Comfy too. Okay. Now we gotta actually make dinner because we're getting within the intermittent fasting window. 7.15, get to finish eating by 8.
You ready to come inside? You ready to come inside? Go see daddy. Wait, 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 wait. Come back, mister. What do you have to do? Sit. Hold on. You good? Now let mama get your collar. Okay. Now go to bed. Go to bed. Go love on dad. Go love on dad. You're gonna go. Go love on dad. You fed Max, right? You fed Max, right? Yeah. <sighs> Mr. Douglas. Come here. Hi, baby boy. Oh, hello. You get the best cuddles in the world. You do. You get the good cuddles. So give good cutters. You do. Y'all are so precious. Y'all are so precious. Did you sleep good? How'd you sleep? Me too. What about you, Allie? How'd you sleep? Why didn't you sleep with us, Leslie? Good morning. Good morning. Salem, why didn't you sleep with us last night? What's with y'all? Why didn't y'all sleep with us? Down two more pounds. because I do have to get ready today. Um, I... <sighs> I just woke up. Um, today's actually... Oh, today's actually the last day that we're working for the week. Um, we, because 4th of July is on a Saturday this year, we get Friday off. So I have some things I have to finish up today. Um, and then... Whenever I get home, I'm going to work out and finish some of this weekend's and next week's blog posts and stuff. Um, so it'll be a busy day for sure, for sure. I have a mosquito bite on the side of my face. How is that even possible? But I'm going to bring you guys along. I'm going to get better about vlogging no matter what. But... What I do in the morning is I usually get up and I need to clean all this office this weekend. Um, I usually get up and I look at my statistics and everything, any followers gained over the night, any YouTube comments that I can um, answer before I have to get ready for work, stuff like that. Simple things. I'll check tracking for packages that literally are taking forever to get here it's really frustrating with the way that USPS is working right now but I get that it's out of their hands they can't help that you know we got another wave of the coronavirus and everything is slow 
Hey babes, so I'm currently pumping gas. I need to do this mess. Um, so it's my lunch break right now and it never takes me an hour to actually eat. So I'm gonna run by a Target really quickly. Um, I need to get some stuff for my nails. My nails have been super unhealthy because they have been so rough on my nails at the nail salon. And so I just was like, I can't go back here if they're just gonna rip my cuticles to pieces and like make my nails brittle. So I gotta get some things to help repair them. Um, I might go to the store after work today to get the stuff for the lake tomorrow. I'm making this pineapple cherry dump cake that Caitlin Covington posted on her um, Instagram stories last night for t at the lake, so I don't know. I'll share that recipe. If not in this vlog, it'll be the next one, but um, I have to go to the store at some point and get groceries and then stuff for the lake so it's gonna be a busy busy next couple of days and then saturday we're gonna have off i'm gonna be at the lake all day with my family and i'm so excited uh, oh my goodness i'm so hot you can't keep your car running when you're getting gas um but it's gonna be a busy few days and i need to be productive like I'm trying to make such good use of my time lately I've been reading the book the audiobook called um girl don't Apo stop apologizing by Rachel I can't think of her last name and she like talks about prioritizing time in there and I was like I need to start doing that got 17.1 gallons of gas my car holds 17 and a half gallons it's crazy okay so I like to jam to my music so I will see you guys at Target with my mask on wear your mother effing masks now more than ever before I was wearing it before, but you best believe I'm gonna wear it now. Don't you just love when there's no cars coming and you can turn into a place without having to stop or wait? It's the little things in life that need to, that bring me joy. I've worked on that for a long time, making finding good joy in the little things makes a big difference. Okay, so I'm at Target now, or I'm about to be at Target. Um, good for you, ma'am, wearing your mask. It's in Greenville County, it is currently mandatory in like certain places. Um, and listen, I get it. It's uncomfortable, it's hot. I literally sweat to death at the nail salon because they already keep it hot in there when I wear my mask. But here's the thing, if wearing a mask, if you wear a mask every day, for a year when you go in public and your mask makes out of that entire year only one person feel more comfortable around you or being near you in a store because you have a mask on then you have done your part and that's like you just need to be other oriented and I think that's what the mask is it's being other oriented and people don't understand that they think it's like political it ain't they think it's like I don't know. I just see the dumbest things on Facebook. It's, it, it's it, all the nurses. Thank you for debunking the crap that says that um, masks lower your oxygen saturation and raise your CO2 levels. I've seen multiple videos. You can look them up. Um, it, it's not unhealthy to wear the mask. Wear the mother effing mask. Okay. Wear the mother effing mask. That's my new, I should wear, I should buy a shirt or find a shirt that says that. Let's go aside. Let's find some nail polish. Oh, hold on, I gotta take one more swig of coffee. Ugh. Am I the only one who literally will drink coffee at four o'clock in the afternoon? Like it does not matter. If I'm not done with my coffee, I will still drink it. Come like, oh, my morning coffee ain't done yet. It could be five o'clock in the afternoon, but I ain't finished my morning coffee. Oh, hoops with the masks. Oh no. All right, note to self, stud earrings when planning to go open places. Okay, hey babes. Okay, 
Okay, so it's a few hours later and I just got home and got a package. I am, my back hurts so bad. I'm like counting down the minutes and the hours until I go to the chiropractor tomorrow. And I know I keep saying that, like I, it's probably so annoying to hear that my back constantly hurts, but <laughs> I don't know what else to do. Okay. What is that? What is a five? Oh well. Um, okay, so a few things I got. I got this shave cream for Billy. A lot of you guys told me to try this. And then I'm assuming everything is in here. Um, okay. Oh, they did put it in here. Okay. I also got a little travel head for my current razor. And the reason being is because, let's see. Do you, how do you open this thing? I just painted my nails. I'm like afraid to, here we go. Um, see how this little case, like it has a little place for the razor to sit so that it doesn't get ruined. Like the blade, the, the head itself, I'm sorry. So I'll show you guys here. This is the razor. I highly recommend the Billy razor. I get why everyone raves about it now. But you can put it in there and it's not gonna like actually let these little, the soft parts of the razor touch so it won't get goopy and gross. But I wanted to get a travel holder because I didn't have one. So I decided because I online, I actually, I feel like it's weird. I'm talking and you guys can't see my face. I actually really like the, um, I really like neutral colors. I don't love blue <laughs> it's not my favorite um but i'm not like opposed to it and so i already had decided like when i went to travel i was just gonna grab another razor because it's such a pain to like have to use your razor shake it off find a home for it so i was like you know what i'm just gonna put put a travel razor together put it in this travel case and be done with it and so i decided i would go ahead and get the blush pink um color as well they have two, they sent two little samples, a shave cream and then the dry by body lotion. Like I said, I got the shave cream. And then this is actually, so this matches the color razor that I got. So I'm going to have to take the blue one off my wall. I know it's super extra, but I got blush pink. I got another Billy razor because it's like nine bucks in blush pink. So, oh yeah, that's way more my vibe. <laughs> extra but I got the blush pink and it comes with a little blush pink holder. So I'm just gonna, and as you can see, like that's, this is the magnet that it hangs on your shower wall with. Very good quality. It was really random of me to just do that, but I have low energy at the current moment. Okay. So that's all the stuff from Billy that I got. Um, and then I also got a dress in. Okay, so Macy's is the weirdest company on the planet when it comes to shipping. <sighs> um, I ordered this dress last Friday. I ordered a free people, this is a free people dress. I ordered a free people jacket the Friday before. This is the dress. This is the dress and the jacket doesn't show up till tomorrow. Like Macy's has the oddest shipping ever. Oh, I can't, I'm about to get up anyway. Just, tomorrow cannot come fast enough. Does it really not say what size I got? All right, hold on. I got the dress in a small, so. It's this really pretty, it's like a blue jean material, but it's this, it, I think the color is ecru. Oh, there's the sizing. So this is a small and they took, oh my gosh, they took the pricing off of it. It's a $125 dress and I bought it for $51 and, um, I'm sorry, 54 total. 
$54.78. So it was a pretty good sale. And then I'm gonna go try it on really quickly. I'll show it to you guys. Oh my gosh, this is really painful. Oh my gosh, okay. First of all, the small was a good choice. A medium would have looked like massive on me, but I love this so much I now want it in the blue. They make like a true blue jean color. The front and the back look exactly the same. Can you guys see that? Oh my gosh, I love this so much. It'll look a lot better when I actually have my tan back, but it's worn off right now and I need to also shave my legs tonight, which is why I was waiting for the Billy Razor to come in. But, oh my gosh, look how pretty. Cannot wait to wear this. Okay, so I will link this below for you guys. I'll link all the stuff that I got from Billy below. Um, any outfits you guys see. Like, I always, I always try to be super conscious of, like, when I watch the video back, I think if I see something on somebody's YouTube channel, would I ask about it? And if I think that I would, like, if I was watching my YouTube channel back and I was not me, this makes any sense at all. I'm not making any sense anymore, Kathy. Um, what I see, like, what would I ask? What questions? Like, what nail color do you have? Like, can I have a link for that dress and all that stuff? So I try to put it in the description bar below for you guys. Um, so I'm going to change now. And then I'm going to head down to my mommy's and I'm going to work out. We, she's actually my workout buddy. I think I've told you guys that before. Um, and I also have it on my vlog channel, like, all about the workout that we do. So if you want to know what we do, then, um, you can definitely check that out. So thank you guys so much for watching the vlog. Sam is actively working like right now. This dress has pockets. Yep, I'm about to get on and buy the blue jean, blue jean one because it has freaking pockets and you can't even tell so it's not like dumpy. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching this vlog. Sam isn't in it because he's working right now. So maybe the next one. But I love you guys and I'll see you next time.